dear students and welcome to this online class video this is the third part of the fifth chapter does it look the same of class 5 subject mathematics let's start the class now let's talk about today's topic so we have only one topic for today's class that is one fourth turn so let's understand this one fourth turn through a picture so here is a boy in this first picture who is in standing position means the legs are downside and hands are upside okay so what will happen in one fourth turn mean in which position he will come to so uh, if you will take a right turn in one fourth so you will get this type of position means a slipping position you will get now this position is known as its one fourth turn if you will take a right turn so now i think you have understand this okay now what will happen if this slipping position will go to another one fourth turn so you will get this type of position picture third okay means uh, just upside down of the first picture how can you say means its hands are downside and legs are upside so this is you can say half are upside down and you can say uh, it is double of one fourth how can you say means Two one fourth makes half, as you know. Okay, two one fourth makes half. In class four, you have studied about it. So, uh, this is just half turn. You can say. Now, what will happen if this position will go to another one fourth turn? So, you will get another uh, one fourth position. Means, us another slipping position. You will get if you will turn it from the right side. Now, in another one fourth turn, you will come back to your original position means in to the picture one you will come so i hope that you have understand one fourth turn through this uh, activity now let's start to read and try to solve some problems of this textbook so does the fan look the same on one fourth turn so you can see here we have a blades of a fan so all blades are colored in blue okay so what will happen if you will take a, a one fourth to the right turn so what will happen this upper blade will come here okay so this is blue and it is also blue so there will be no change so here you can see a one fourth turn so there are no changes in this type of shape so now come to the next page now will this fan also look the same after one fourth turn draw in the yellow box so at first we will observe this picture properly so you can see the blades are in same size but the colors are different means one blue then one yellow then one blue then another yellow so what will happen in one fourth turn so let's try to draw it okay i am just making the blades of this fan okay so now if we if we will fill the colors so here will we will get the blue one blue blade and here also another blue one and in top and bottom we will get our yellow colors so you can see after one fourth turn the picture is not looking the same as its previous picture so now next we have a practice time so question a is among the following shapes find out which ones would look the same after one fourth turn okay so we have a tick for one fourth turn remember it okay means if you will take a uh, if you will put a tick so that it will be a one fourth turn and another is a cross for the not look the same after half turn so dear student just try to understand tick means one fourth turn okay and cross means not looking uh, the same as half turn so here we have our first picture that is a that is in a triangular shape so let's try to understand this one so in one fourth turn it will come to the right side like this okay so it will not look the same so you do not uh, put a tick now you know, check the check for the half turn so in half turn uh, it will look like this so and this is not same 
as its original picture so now here you will put a cross okay because cross means not uh, looking the same as in half turn now come to the second picture we have a house okay you can see this is a house and these are windows and uh, so check for one fourth turn in one fourth turn how it will look it will look like this so this is not same so you can't uh, uh, put a tick here so now check for a cross means not half turn so in half turn it will look like this so it is not same as its previous picture in half turn so here you will also put a cross so picture one and picture two you will put a cross now come to the next page here we have many pictures so one by one we will try to solve this all so come to the third picture so these are two circles with blue one and another one is in uh, you can see sky blue so what will happen in one fourth turn in what one fourth turn the blue circle will come out uh, upper side and another one will come to the down side so it is not same so you can't put a tick here now check for half turn in half turn it will also not same why because it has two different colors so here for the third picture you will put a cross okay remember this now come to the fourth picture we have a, a square divided in four equal small squares and all have same colors red 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 so in one fourth turn it will look the same and yes and now in half turn yes it will also look the same so you cannot put a cross here so fourth will be tick now in fifth picture you have also another square but with different colors so in one fourth turn what will happen the color will be changed okay so it will not look the same in one fourth turn and in half turn it will also change so here you will put a cross because in half turn it will not look the same now in sixth picture yes we can see that it's a very beautiful picture and it's all sides are same means its border are triangular and in the center we have a square and outer side we have it's a octagon okay triangle octagon and square so in one fourth turn definitely it will look the same so you can put a tick here and in half turn it will look the same so you cannot uh, put a cross here now come to the seventh number picture in one fourth turn it will not look the same so you cannot uh, uh, put a tick here and in half turn it will not look the same so you will put a cross here and in eighth picture you have a circle means it's a wheel and it is in circular so in one fourth turn definitely it will look the same so just put a tick without any doubt and in half turn definitely it will look the same so you cannot put a cross here so in this way we have solved this now come to the b question b so try and change the shapes in such a way that the new shape remains the same on giving it half a turn so we have to give half turn to this all pictures but we have to change the shape of this pictures so first we have here so we have a circle and upper side we have a square so there are many ways to change this all first you can draw another square here with the same color remember this okay you have to take half turn and so all things should be same so here we have a yellow color for the square so definitely you will feel yellow color for this square so this is the first and in another way what you can do just put this square at the center okay so this is the second way to change its shape and in half turn definitely it will look the same now come to the next picture here we have a, a square and circles with different colors so you can see these corners have white circles okay center have red so everything is same remaining this blue circle so here you have to put a circle and you have to fill with blue color remember this then it will be look the same and in half turn it will look same so in this way you can do it do it and 
and now come to the third so you can see these two are same but left and right are not equal so here you can put a circle and must color this with the same color remember it now here we have another picture so circle and triangles so circle will be same and triangles you can change the shape of this triangle so just make yeah the second triangle you will put like this then it will look like the same and here you have uh, oval shapes uh, semicircle picture so what you will do the color is same so what you will do just make their color same okay their colors were different so you have to make you have to color it with the same color then it will look like the same so in this way you can uh, solve this all questions now we have question c draw what the following shapes would look like on one fourth turn and half turn so we have to give these all pictures one fourth turn and half turn so one by one we will do the do it so come to the first one it is a triangle so to the means yes to the right side we will take turns so here we have a triangle so right side turn in one fourth it will look like this okay now a square a square will look like same here we have a rectangle so in one fourth turn it will look like this we are rotating to the left to right remember it now here we have a hexagon so it will look like this yeah i have done this all now on half turn how it will look so triangle is here so triangle will look like this just upside down a square will look same rectangle we have so yeah it will look the same and here we have hexagon so also it will look the same in this way we have the one fourth turns and half turns so here i have a question for you all that uh, in one fourth turn which which pictures are looking same triangle is not looking same a square is looking same a rectangle is not looking same and hexagon is also not looking same in one fourth turn and in half turn you can see which are looking same triangle is not looking same a square is looking same in half turn rectangle is also looking same and hexagon is also looking same so in this way you have found your answer and here we have a question that which of the above shapes do not look the same on one fourth turn we have already answered this which shapes do not do not look the same on half turn we have already answered this one only triangle okay only triangle was not looking same in half turn and now we have another question with fan so which fan will look the same on one third turn so now what is one third turn so just look at this one picture okay then we will understand that what is one third so we have three blades the first one is green and another two are marrow so in first one third turn what will happen this blade means this green blade will come here okay in left turn but if you will take a right turn so this green blade will come here okay in right turn right one third turn and what will happen this one blade will come here and this maroon one will come here means if i will explain this one so it will look like this yeah left side you can see that i am just trying to coloring this so in one third turn this picture will look like this so it was its one third turn so i hope that you have understand and the question was which fan look the same on one third turn so no doubt the picture a is with the same color so it will look like the same but picture b is not with the same colors so it will not look the same now we have our next question that is draw the shape after one third turn so here we have a big triangle with red color and a small triangle in a white color so in one third turn how it will look so if i will take a right turn for this so i will get uh, let me change the color first yeah i am taking the black color yes okay so 
okay if i will take a right turn for this uh, triangular shape so it will look like this uh, first upper shape i am making then down and okay then a small triangle like this and now i will color this one so this part i will color with red and the inner portion means for the small triangle we will color white so i am just coloring this triangle yeah and the center one will look in white color so yeah this is the one third turn of the of this picture so you can see that it is just looking same yeah in one third turn it is looking same so now that's all for today's class dear students in today's class we have completed we have known one fourth turn and one third turn i hope that you have very well understand this all and if you will like this if you like this video so must subscribe my channel and share with your friends till then stay at home be healthy and bye bye